Hey everybody, Marcos Viegas here being joined with Gennady Golovkin where you just did a signing, man. You had a lot yeah. of people come over here. Uh, I want to say at one day. point uh, over 300, but how did it feel to have all these people see you and uh, get uh, your signature and all that? No, I'm very excited. Just respect my fans. I'll just present to my fans. You surprised? No, this is my second time, you know, like this, like big uh, Instagram session. Today is a busy day, long day. Yeah, it's been a long day yeah. for me, man. Uh, so uh, a little event happened, uh, the weigh-in. I wanted to go ahead and show you uh, the weigh-in between Canelo and, and Amir Khan and, and kind of get your thoughts on how Canelo looked and uh, really your thoughts uh, on the fight tomorrow. So I'm going to go ahead and play what Canelo looks right here at the weigh-in, and I want to get your thoughts on, on how he looks body-wise. One sixty five, yeah, fifty five. He said he's look he said he feel good. You know? It's no problem. How do you look to you? Because Abel said he felt he looked a, a little drained. Did you note that at all? I think too much for him. You know he, this is his style, his business, you know. It's not interesting, uh, it's fifty five or one sixty or for everybody, you know, he said he feel good. For everybody, he looked terrible, you know. Mm -hmm. It's okay. What do you think is going to happen on Saturday? Do you think that he's just too big for Amir Khan? I think he's yeah, too strong. You know, Amir Khan, he is a good boxer. He a good warrior. And I think Canelo, he's too big, too strong, you know. It's a different situation. I don't know, this surprise, this is boxing. Mm -hmm. Now, earlier in the week, uh, and I've told... Uh, other people, this observation that us in the media had, it seemed to be that you, at the topic of, of a potential fight with Canelo, kind of overshadowed Amir Khan. I, I want to say just about all the questions were directed towards Canelo and his team about a potential fight with you. And each time he would respond with, well, I don't think Gennady deserves the fight yet. And he was saying based on the opponents you had, and, and he says that, Hey, you know, I face Mayweather, all these other guys. Gennady hasn't faced guys like that. Make him face a, a, a guy with a big name and then we'll talk. Yeah, you know, just, this is not respect to boxing. Mm -hmm. Not respect to boxing. This doesn't matter. Team, Cornell, or Oscar, or. Doesn't matter. When you hear things like that, and knowing you're the middleweight champion of the world, considered the best in the division, does it get you angry or frustrated yeah. hearing that? No, I'm not angry, you know, just I uh, see he, his face, you know, I see Golden Boy job, you know, this is terrible. This is terrible, this is not respect. On Sunday, May 8th, are you going to give a call to Tom and be like, hey, you know, how, how is this going on? Like, how are you going to be on that Sunday? I'm wait, I'm wait, <laughs> just, you know, just uh, a couple, couple hours, just yeah. maybe, you know, just two days. It's good. <laughs> very interesting. I'm very excited. <laughs> well, Gennady, thank, thank you, you so much. I know this was uh, on short notice here with Gennady Golovkin. Of course, this Saturday, HBO pay-per-view, Canelo Alvarez versus Amir Khan.